We're Will and Jen. Last week, we started a cross-country road trip from Maryland to Wyoming and made our first stop in Chicago, where we saw Millennium Park, tried Chicago-style pizza, and went kayaking down the Chicago River. This week, we continue our journey out west, follow along as we check out the Mall of America in Minneapolis, and then drive across South Dakota, stopping at some beautiful places along the way. Good morning, guys. So we're back for another day of driving. And we made it to Madison, Wisconsin last night, but we were a bit outside of Madison. And so um, before we hit the road, we decided we at least drive through, see kind of like downtown Madison. So we're gonna pass by the capital of Wisconsin and um, just oh, check it out. Oh, the Yeah, that's a, the Capitol building. Oh, cool. So we're just gonna check that out and then start the drive to Minneapolis. going to get to see of Madison today so hopefully we can come back again next time and explore the city a little bit more a classic cliche we're on the run this is what we waited for we've seen let it go with this guy who does Disney voices so we're gonna try to imitate that in whatever parts are in this video we're gonna put the actual character the snow goes white on the mountain tonight not a footprint to be seen. Don't let them in, don't let them see. Be the good girl you always have to be. Let it go, <laughs> let it go. Turn away and slam the door. I don't care what they're going to. Squirrel! <laughs> let the storm rage on. <laughs> Never bothers me anyway. you got oh, let it go! Let it go! I'll rise like the break of dawn! <laughs> Here I'll stand in the light of day! <laughs> Let the storm rage on! <laughs> the cold never bothered me anyway! <laughs> <laughs> Good job, everybody. Can I now have some honey? Mm. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Be free with me. Be free. Be free with me. So I kind of told him, I was like, I feel like if we leave Wisconsin and we don't get some cheese. Can you really say you've been to Wisconsin? Right, like, can you truly say you've been there? So we decided to stop. This is a local cheese farm off the highway. And we got we got more than I was intending to because Will's parents wanted some. But um, I actually, and I got some sausage too and crackers. So once we get to Wyoming, we can have cheese and crackers. And I also got some wild blackberry honey. Oh, mom. nice. We were hoping that they had fried cheese curds, but they don't have them. They said to go to the A&W. <laughs> 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 they're, they're, like, they're made local and fried. No. But we're not gonna have time for that. But we got cheese though, that's local made. With me. never met in person we used to work together and she lives right outside Minneapolis so we decided to meet up and meet in person for the first time so it was so nice meeting her so shout out to Kayla hmm. matter Jen you're walking your dog it's too hot Stone Arch Bridge, which my friend who lives around here recommended to see. So we just stopped by. Tuck you want me to carry him now? Yeah, Tucker's heavy. <laughs> He's a big boy. Hold on. Wow, this is a great view. It really is. You're gonna 
to do it the whole way, so. No, the grass is right there. Oh, okay, cool. What a good doggy uncle. It's very hot in Minnesota today. It's like 95 degrees, so the, it's too hot for, for a little puppy to walk. <laughs> <You're right>. yeah. <laughs> oh, so we finally made it to the Mall of America, which is the largest mall in the United States, and it's actually complete with an entire amusement park, an aquarium, mini golf, escape rooms, hotels, restaurants, and of course a lot of shopping. So is it just me, or does Spongebob and Patrick remind you of Matt and Will? <laughs> <laughs> and then Will's like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, I, I will say, I might not be a Spongebob, but Will is definitely a Patrick. You're def you are the definition of a human Spongebob. <laughs> I kind of like, look you like- you literally laugh like- <laughs> like, like if Spongebob was a human, it would be in, in my you're, proportionate you're, perplexion. <laughs> <laughs> you're what? <laughs> It does have like epic comedy. It does. This is the famous Carlos Bakery from Cake Box. Um, you like that show, right? Yeah, I love it. I, I never watch it anymore, but I used to love it. Yeah. I used to watch Haven't it you time. been to the one in New Jersey? In New Jersey, yep. Yeah, uh, that's the original the actual one, right? Cake Boss. So I don't even like cake that much, but these cakes legit look so good. Matt said he wants a piece of red velvet, so I might just have a bite of his. Are you getting something? <laughs> <Just> <laughs> Does, what? what does Matt always say? Just bear poop in the woods? <laughs> <laughs> what slice? What kind are you getting? I don't know. I'm gonna wait till we get closer. Uh, I gotta get a cannoli. You gotta inspect all of your choices. Yeah. Murderer. <laughs> what did you just do, Will? We hit a bird. We? We? He said we. What? He said we hit a bird. Are Me? you are you driving? No. Am I driving? Poor Will. Will's a murderer. <laughs> murderer. It hit the bird, right? Uh -huh. He Will purposely. No, I didn't. No. Yeah, purposely hit that bird. And then <laughs> boom. <laughs> and then I look up and then it lands on the road. Shane. You want this pop cup? Oh, the little pop cup. This is just a spoon. Oh, it's not a bone? No, it is, but it's like oh, it's, one spoon. That is so cute. Like, who would have thought it Arby's? So we made it to Sioux Falls last night, but we got here uh, when it was already dark. And when we got here to our room, we saw we had like a balcony and everything, but we didn't realize till we got up this morning that we're actually right next to a golf course. It's pretty, huh? It is. I think that's the airport out there too. Tuck, don't growl at the golfers. No. This is, this is my house. This is my house. You're hitting all these balls in my house. Around my yard property. My property. So as we mentioned, we stayed in the town of Sioux Falls, South Dakota last night, which is actually the most populated city in South Dakota. And it's called Sioux Falls for a reason, because there's a huge waterfall that runs down in the middle of the city. So we're gonna go check it out before we get back on the road today. drive is a little boring. We do have a couple really fun stops planned on the drive today. Hey 
everybody. This land is your land. This land is my land. From California to the New York Islands to the Redwood Forest to the Gulf Stream waters. This land was made for you and me. One more time. This land, this land is my land. From California to the New York Islands to the Redwood Forest to the Gulf Stream waters. This land was made for you and me. Oh. Look at that harmony. Yeah. yeah. We should quit our jobs and be the next Panatonic. My legs hurt from stopping. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why the hell we were driving through South Dakota and didn't plan to stop at Badlands National Park. We were like driving down the road and we're like, we just like, see the rocks. I feel like we should stop here. Like right. we're already all the way in South Dakota and we're not gonna. Get I mean, to look say, at that. Right. Like, so we're we're gonna drive through it all. <laughs> Even if we're tired at the show, we're doing it. Yep. I'm not gonna lie, I am hungry AF, but I think it's gonna be worth it. Me too. And then I'm gonna need a Snickers because I'm gonna have a BF. But I'd rather have a BF in the Badlands. <laughs> I got a muffin. Oh, can I have that muffin? Oh, a muffin. Do you know the Muffin Man? Which the Muffin Man? man? Hello. Hello. How are you? All thank right, you. Thank you. Okay, fun fact, guys. So, part of the reason why we weren't thinking Badlands is because we are on a time crunch and, and we want to hit Wall Drug for lunch. And, but we're doing like a Badlands loop, which is a horseshoe. So we're about 30 minutes away from Wall Drug. This one's gonna take us about 50 minutes, but we're driving through the Badlands. And I can add another national park to my list. So where are we at, Jen? We are at Badlands National Park. We just got into the park and they have a little place where you can pull over and kind of walk up on the rocks. I feel like we're gonna drag this <laughs> loop out. All right, I, you wanna good. climb up there? Yeah. I think up here is gonna be your best shot, Jen. Careful, Matt. Please don't injure yourself. <laughs> <laughs> we climbed up a mountain that had to be a thousand feet in elevation. <laughs> That is so cool. Oh my gosh, look at that. What is it? Well, get up there. Let's get a selfie. So, Jen, yeah. tell everybody what this is for me. Careful, oh, Tuck. oh, 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 oh. <laughs> This is Matt's first national park and you, he acts like a kid in a candy store. I like, promise you, I've never been to a national park. He's like, and I haven't been to a lot, but like, he's just in awe of the nature. This is like a whole new world to me. I'm like, I'm about to get like a class B motorhome now and wow. just travel all the national He's, parks. Matt is ready to change his whole identity in life. Now you get the class Bs, don't you? Right, I mean, this is cool. Like being able to stay right here. This reminds me of Aruba when we went um, yeah. on the tour with Durgan. Exactly. And remember we had to go down to that, where you could see Venezuela? What was that? It was some natural bridge that isn't as popular. So like, it's like 85 degrees, but the wind feels really good. Yeah. So what are we getting, Jen? We are getting badges, right? Yep. Or are they patches? Patches. Yes. I'm gonna be a collector now. Junior Ranger. <laughs> That's you. 
This is pretty. Do you get all of them? Do you get one of them? Yeah. Which one are we supposed to get? I don't think I want a patch because you iron it on and it's like, I don't have anything I want to iron on. I want to put this on our like RV or a car. Mm. Look, it's a prairie dog. Yeah. But I think you're supposed to get a patch. You don't have to. Yeah, I kind of don't want a patch either. What are you going to put a patch on? Right. So Matt loves doing his souvenir pennies. Well, I was going to get a patch. So, I'm not trying to sound like a penny snob. <laughs> but anybody who collects these knows you're supposed to do them in pre-1982 pennies. Well, they were copper because these are zinc. But... And uncirculated, right? So yeah. So they're still shiny. Yeah. But beggars can't be choosers. <laughs> I did a bad roll. So you're, are you getting a Badlands and We're a Mount the same Rushmore? One. No, no, no. We'll get Mount Rushmore at Mount Rushmore. Hopefully they have it. That's the rules. Yeah. See, it's rolling it short. Oh. That's what happens when you use zinc. <laughs> the nerve of them to give you zinc. Wow, All how right. disappointing. <laughs> <laughs> So we just got done lunch. It was drug food. I mean drug store food. I would need to be on drugs the next time I ate this food. It wasn't that bad. It was okay. It was just cheap food. It was more honestly just like the experience of the whole place. I was it's so so crowded. So busy. Yeah. Now why did we decide to come here? So Will and I our favorite YouTubers are named Kara and Nate. If you guys don't know them, I'll link their channel up above, but they're pretty big on YouTube and they've been traveling for like the last four plus years. A couple months ago, they came here and made a whole video out of being here for 24 hours. So since we were driving through, I was like, we gotta stop at Wall Drug because Karen and Nate were here. And it's kind of funny walking through, like seeing all the places that they were in their videos, but it's a lot more crowded this time of year in the summer than it was, I think, when they came. So this part of the video is kind of dedicated to them and also something funny about Kara and Nate is they own a company called Fairdrop which um, sends flight deals to people based on you set preferences of where you want to go to and what your home airport is and they'll send you flight deals. They were looking for a designer a couple months ago and so I applied and I'm now the designer for Fairdrops. So I'm working on the new landing page, working on the new product and everything. And um, it's just great getting to work with them and, and help out with Fairdrop. That's like being Derek Jeter's bat boy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> like, that's pretty cool. Yeah, it's pretty surreal working with them. So, mm. so also, yeah. the last job I had that I think I've mentioned on here before is I was a designer for a company full time. This is my second week off from that company. I actually left, um, I'm doing, along with Fairdrop, I'm planning on doing more freelance design work, trying to help Will build the real estate business, working on flipping houses and some other things going on. So it was like finally a, the right time for me to leave and be able to work on those things. So it's, that's kind of the reason why we can even do this road trip like we are, because every day we're like driving and moving around. And normally I wouldn't be able to do that. Normally I'd pretty much be limited to weekends, so. That's really exciting. Fairdrops definitely like help with that transition too of getting having like that freelance um, job in the meantime. So yeah, that's kind of exciting news. Come on, I want to ride the jackalope. <laughs> so Jen, what do you think? <laughs> if you've ever driven from North Carolina to South Carolina, you've probably seen no. south of the border. Yes. The signs everywhere. It is essentially the same type of thing. It's a better version. Better, for sure. Be yeah, a little bit cleaner, a little bit better, but essentially the same thing. Very touristy. But yeah, this is like the western version of south of the border. Good. I never be back here with you doing this drive again. Oh yeah, you probably would. I'll be so happy just to see another human being. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> In the turn of events, we just saw elk. Welcome to Bear Country, USA, drive through wildlife park. Another detour on our trip. Look, Tucker, look. Look at those things. Oh, look, Tucker. Look. 
Okay, the next thing is reindeer. <gasps> oh, I see one over there. Do you? Hi. Look at them. Oh my God. That Look at those hairy antlers. That thing would go right through the car. Yeah, the window's not going to save us. <laughs> right. Arctic wolves. Oh, so There's so no way we're free roaming with Arctic wolves. <laughs> oh, this is chilling on the rock. There's one right there. Guys. Yeah, Where? I thought you saw that. No. You see yeah. one right there? The big one? Yeah. What the fuck? Yeah. Up. I didn't see up. that one. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. I could beat up that bear. You were so dumb. No, no, no. I, I will tell you this. I know I'd lose to a bear. But I could straight up take a crocodile. <laughs> I'm convinced. First off, there's no crocodiles in America. Okay, I could take an alligator, crocodile. You know, you hear about these alligators biting dogs. If a if a alligator was to attack Yuna, I'd big boot that. Son of a <laughs> I feel like that guy that went in with a cigar. Hell yeah! <laughs> I'd just rip it open with my hands. Oh, there's another bear. He's like, oh. look at me. Oh. Look at me, baby. I'm over here too, guys. <laughs> that looks like Yuna. If Yuna was a bear. <laughs> <laughs> Look, like, what about me? Is oh, is he moving? Oh, he is. Oh, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> look at that. Oh my god. Jen, get Tucker. Get Tucker. You need to calm him down. Tucker, stop. It's a good time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at Tucker. Good boy, Tucker. You did get that bear. <laughs> the bear passed right in front of us. He's a good boy. Damn, I didn't even see that bear. I wasn't even looking. <laughs> right Tucker saw him. Tucker saw him. Goodbye, bear. <laughs> oh see you right later. Right. Well, I'm next to Buffalo! Buffalo! Bison. Buffalo! Bison. Oh, there's the buffalo. Now we're on our way to Mount Rushmore. So at, when you're entering like Mount Rushmore, they have all the state flags and all the U.S. territory flags. So we came over to see Maryland. There it is. Right there, right in the middle. We should and try to find Texas. Guy. That's where I was born. Oh yeah, yeah. Will was born in Texas. Let's try to find that. Maryland is actually very proud of a state flag. Yeah. I don't know if every state's that way. Maryland does have a cool flag though. Maybe I'm just like biased because yeah, I grew up there. The Here's Texas down here. Oh yeah. The Lone Star State. <laughs> so, the machine, I had to go all the way back for the uh, penny machine and it rolled really, really well. Oh wow, that one is good. And this one rolled really well. A little off, but close. And for all my, but still, mm -hmm. I, I would actually consider them not perfect, but compared to uh, Badlands, this uh, is this is a lot better, but what makes them super rare in the uh, penny collector game is when they say the location on the Ooh. back. That's why it's pretty special. So I'm happy now. It was worth 3,000 miles to get here. But there's zinc, so. Right, they, the old ones actually press better. The copper. Holy crap, Will, how do you know this? I just know. Yeah, Aww. yeah. the pre-1982s press better. Yeah. Because they're all copper. Have you ever put one under a train when I was coming? Have you ever done that? Yeah, of course. No, you haven't. Yes, I have. Oh, okay. Can right. grab his bowl? Yeah. Boogie out of here. Let's boogie on down. <laughs> to the show we go. Let's go, Boogie. Honestly, can I tell you guys something? What? This is one of the funnest days I've ever had. In your whole life? Yeah, seriously. Oh. Well, I actually had a lot of fun. I'm like actually quite amazed that we saw Sioux Falls this morning. Then went to Badlands National Park, hit Wall Drug, that was there. And Wall then Mount stopped. Rushmore, and now we're about to drive through Black 
mountain forest or whatever. Yeah, we're in the Black Hills. And then we're gonna officially get into Wyoming. That's a pretty epic day. Today was a good day. No. <laughs> There's no artificial preservatives. I don't want it. I love the grass here. <laughs> the grass is always greener. So. There's some primitive people in their natural habitat. Stop. Did you see them? And Jen, you gotta sing it with me. Ready? I don't want to redo this again. I really don't. I have no, no, no. Because I got the chorus. I hate the blue You're not going to yellow. No. Yeah. I, I don't do anything with the color yellow in it. <laughs> How do I get down? Same way you got up. <laughs> if anybody's pooping on this rock, it's me. Ow, my eye has sweat. Ow, ow, hang on. Cut. You're clear. <laughs> Jed. Yes. <Jeez. Yeah. laughs> hey, I'm driving here. <laughs> <laughs> 